To find your perfect sensitivity, go on any private server with a map of your choice. Pick your class main. If you don't have a main class, then just choose one of the Sniper, Spy, Engineer, or Pyro, which all move at relatively similar speeds. Go into the level and find yourself in a wide open spot here. You're going to want to make a small mark on the wall that you can trace around with your cursor. Do this with one of your weapons. Now you'll want to set your sensitivity to something low, like 2 or 3. You're going to be changing your sensitivity a lot, so always remember what your previous sensitivity was. Now all you'll want to do is strafe back and forth using the A and D keys. You'll want to keep your crosshair on this target as much as possible. There's two things you want to watch out for. Your One of them is whether your aim is twitching around or not, and whether your aim is lagging behind slightly. If your aim is lagging behind, you'll just want to raise it, so multiply your sensitivity by 2. Remember, you'll slowly want to strafe back and forth while keeping your crosshair on the target as much as possible. I'm still lagging behind a bit, so I'll raise my sensitivity again. This time I'm multiplying my current sensitivity, 2, by 2, so I'll get 4. Obviously now you can see my aim is twitching all over the place, and is staying relatively off of the target. In this case, where your aim is way too high, you'll want to set your sensitivity in between your previous sensitivity and the sensitivity you have now. That means that I'll get about 3. You'll want to repeat this process over and over until you get as precise number as possible. My perfect sensitivity right now is 2.75, which I use for all of my games. I recommend that you use the same sensitivity for all of your games and not switch up. So yeah, that's how you find your perfect sensitivity. This also works for games like CSGO. Hope you liked it, and uh, thank you for watching.